Have you ever wondered what gives life to a giant ship that weighs thousands of tons and carries cargo across the oceans? It's not magic, it's the main engine. Today, let's dive deep into the heart of the ship and understand the difference between a two-stroke engine and a four-stroke engine. Think of the main engine as the heartbeat of a vessel. Without it, the ship is just a floating box on the water. But with it, that box turns into a powerful machine, capable of moving across seas and connecting the world. Let's start with the two-stroke engine. Imagine an athlete who gives his maximum energy with every step powerful. That's what a two-stroke engine is for ships. It completes one power cycle in just two strokes of the piston down and up. This means more power is generated in less time. These engines are huge, slow-speed giants directly connected to the ship's propeller. That's why most ocean-going vessels use two-stroke engines there, built for efficiency, fuel economy, and non-stop global trade. Now, let's meet the four-stroke engine. Unlike the two-stroke, this one is like a marathon runner steady, reliable, but designed for smaller distances. It needs four strokes of the piston intake, compression power, and exhaust to complete one cycle. These engines are medium to high speed, lighter in weight, and often used in smaller vessels, ferries, and as auxiliary engines on big ships. The two-stroke engine is the heavyweight boxer slow but with knockout punches, perfect for pushing massive ships across oceans. The four-stroke engine is the agile fighter faster, plighter, and best for smaller or quicker tasks. So, why should we care about this difference? because the type of engine decides the ship's design, speed, fuel consumption, and even how much cargo it can carry. The engine is not just a machine, it's the deciding factor of how the world's trade moves. Next time you see a massive container ship or even a ferry, remember the beating heart inside could either be a two-stroke or a four-stroke main engine, silently working day and night to keep the world connected. That's the real power behind shipping. If you found this explanation interesting, make sure to hit the like button, subscribe, and stay tuned for more videos where we explore the secrets of marine engineering.